So one thing I maybe haven't talked a whole lot about on this channel is that I'm a gamer. And I probably spend a little more time than I would like to admit playing video games. But that doesn't necessarily mean I'm good at it. I just spend way more time than I probably should doing it. Here, let me show you around the studio real quick. Over here, we've got my Nintendo Switch. I usually use this when traveling. On the other side of the studio, we've got my PlayStation 5. This is my console games that I play up on my big screen. I even have the brand new Oculus Quest Pro, and ooh, this thing is beautiful. I'm also a big mobile gamer of just playing games on my phone. And down here under my desk, we've got my gaming PC, which is actually perfect because the sponsor of today's video is Tower of Fantasy. And Tower of Fantasy is a shared open world MMORPG available on PC and mobile platforms. You get to challenge some difficult bosses and explore a brand new world. Plus, they just launched their Vera expansion. So I'll tell you more about it in just a little bit. And so I don't know about you guys, but when I get started on a brand new game, it basically consumes my entire life. So here's what I'm thinking. I want to build a Swiss army knife of a keyboard. So basically, this thing is going to have everything I need to sit here all day long and just play video games and I'll never have to leave my desk. And I will be the laziest yet hopefully most productive player this game has ever seen. All right, we've got our keyboard here and this is what I was thinking for the game plan. Around the main body of the keyboard, I was gonna design a housing that it would perfectly sit in, and this would act as the main bracket. Then, inside that bracket, there would be all of these different locations that would act as modular mounting points. And from those mounting points, we would have all sorts of different compartments that would be interchangeable. And yeah, hopefully that makes sense. Don't look at that one I drew on the right. It's not good, but let's go build it. So I think it's safe to say that my 3D design skills are a little bit better than my drawing skills. The one thing I didn't think about is this keyboard is a little bit big and is it going to fit on my biggest build plate? All right, I think if I do it sideways, we should be good. So let's get this thing fired up here. Hit print, keyboard, print. Okay, so while this thing actually gets going on the print, let's start up Tower of Fantasy and start my new gaming obsession. Time to take a break because it is done on the 3D printers. Here is a first look at the main housing for our Swiss Army keyboard. <laughs> One sec, let's just do a quick comparison. Let's see how it looks compared to the drawing. The drawing, 3D design. The drawing, 3D design. Uh, all right, I think we can agree this is better. So like I also mentioned in our lovely drawing, these mounting points are all gonna be modular and we have to just install a little magnet on the inside of them so that all of the different pieces that we make for it snap into place. So we'll just put a little bit of glue inside of here and slide our magnet in. Easy peasy. Although one thing I probably should have double checked is, is the keyboard gonna fit inside of here? We'll grab this and slide it into place. Like a glove, it fits beautifully like a glove. The first thing that we're gonna use for the modular thing just got here. Um, got the pizza for you? Yep. Sorry about the delay. Yeah, no worries. Awesome, thanks yeah, so much. Have a great day. You too. If I'm gonna be doing an all day gaming marathon, I'm gonna need some pizza and a drink and maybe a few other snacks. So those should be the first three modular compartments for our Swiss Army keyboard. A plate, a bowl, and a cup holder. Let's do it. <sighs> Part number one, we've got ourselves a cup holder. Part number two, we've got ourselves a nice bowl. And last but not least, we have ourselves a plate 
for the pizza. And I went ahead and added the magnets in here, so let's see how they connect up to the base. All right, cup fit test number one. It's perfect. And it snaps right into place. We can test out the bowl and of course the plate. And as I mentioned earlier, we can just sort of mix and match and decide where we want each plate to actually go when we're using it at the computer. And before we tackle the next component, a quick message from our sponsor. Tower of Fantasy is an open world MMORPG available on PC and mobile platforms. And they just released their Vera expansion, which includes an all new map so you can explore all the great things Vera has to offer. Explore the new city Mirrory, a brand new cyberpunk city floating above the desert. Explore the Mirrorfleur Hall, Veritown Fantasy, Mirora Archives, and Guada Studio. And the great story adventure continues with all new story quests. Plus, the new character Ruby is a cool character that looks harmless but can deal a lot of damage. Join her friend and weapon Sparky in a brand new story. The entrance of Grey Space appears in the wild and it's a great challenge for a limited time. Plus, join your friends in the multiplayer mode to fight bosses, discover the world, and enjoy transportation together. Click the link in my bio to download Tower of Fantasy today and explore the new Vera expansion. Okay, so now that we can see this thing starting to take shape, don't forget to comment down below what you think the very last compartment should be. I'm gonna leave that one open and we're gonna make a YouTube short making that one based on one of your suggestions. Okay, but two things. Now that I've eaten a whole bunch of that pizza and I'm getting a little bit tired from working on this project, I've got my next two expansion compartments thought up. The first one is gonna be a compartment for a whole bunch of five hour energy because if I'm gonna be gaming all weekend long, I'm gonna need some energy. And the second one, after eating all that pizza, my teeth feel grimy. So I'm gonna need a place to put my toothbrush. Also, maybe a razor to keep my mustache looking real good. So those are the next two. Okay, I'm just too excited to get these ones out, so let's just go ahead. And just like that, we've got our two new pieces for the Swiss Army controller, we've got our toothpaste and razor holder, and we've got our five hour energy holder. Let's go ahead and pop this one right into there. And for the second one, let's maybe pop it in right there. <laughs> and now we just need to load it up with some five hour energies. So we got compartment for three of them. So now we're gonna have 15 hours of energy inside of here. And we've got our toothbrush and razor, so we can just slide those both into these compartments right here. And let's see, oh, it looks like the toothpaste is just barely gonna fit. But overall, I think these two are a fantastic addition to the Swiss Army keyboard. And okay, I feel like I need to redeem myself a little bit from the last video. Everyone got all up in arms because I cut up that MagSafe charger and didn't add the MagSafe charging capabilities into the eye dangle. Well, today we're gonna change that. So as I mentioned earlier, Tower of Fantasy is actually a multiplayer game. I don't know anyone that plays it yet, but I can have two different accounts on my phone and on my computer to team up with myself to beat different bosses. So using this MagSafe charger, I thought I would A, keep it together, and B, design a charging mount for my phone that I could A, keep it there the whole time, and B, use it to multitask and play with myself in two different accounts. And for the last part, I think I'm gonna keep it a little bit of a secret. You see, I got this brand new 3D printer right here, so I thought, let's put it to the test and print the final piece on that printer and really find out how that printer prints. Let me just say it's oddly warm in Vermont today and that will be your only clue for what I'm gonna print over there. Okay, I'll tell you the secret modular device. It was a fan. So now I can stay nice and cool while I'm gaming. But would you just look at all of these different compartments all together in one piece? Oh. So we've got the new MagSafe phone charger here, charging up my phone. We've got a little bowl of snacks hiding out over here. We've got my sanitation bin. We've got the fan here. We've got my five hour energy. We've got my pizza and my little drink holder for when I get a little bit thirsty. But man, all together this thing looks so good. And as I mentioned, we still have one compartment that isn't filled up yet. And that's where you guys come in. <laughs> I am never 
gonna have to leave my desk ever to stop playing video games now. I've also eaten way too much pizza already while making this invention, but that should be okay. Oh, I just love all of the different pieces. I'm also doubling down. I've got it running on my phone and I've got it running up on my PC. <laughs> Cause what else more do I need than this whole setup here? All right, we're back in the game. I think I need some pizza to get started up. Delicious, amazing. And I don't even think I'm ever gonna have to leave my desk right here. It has been a long day of building, so maybe I'll grab a five hour energy and get myself going here. Once again, I would like to thank Tower of Fantasy for sponsoring this video today. Be sure to check out the link in my bio to download the game and check out the new Vera expansion. Also, let me know if you download it down in the comments and maybe you can add me and I'll actually have friends and I won't have to play with myself in multiplayer mode. <laughs> That's pretty sad. So with that, I am gonna boot up Tower of Fantasy and I am not going to be leaving this seat until my next unnecessary invention. See ya!